and more local sexual assault survivors are looking for help since Dr. Christine Ford went public with her experience. Now that's according to leaders of the Shelby County Rape Crisis Center. Local 24's Mary Jo Ola, she's live in the studio tonight with the trend that advocates are seeing and how to help survivors. Mary Jo. Yeah, Katina, as Ford's story, what nationwide advocates tell me it resonated with sexual assault survivors in the Mid-South and that her testimony is close to what they hear almost every day. Since Dr. Christine Blasey Ford went public with sexual assault claims against Supreme Court nominee Brett Kavanaugh, Shelby County's Rape Crisis Center says they've seen an increase in phone calls. They're getting, like I said, repeat calls from the past, uh, survivors that they've served in the past, and then also new survivors calling for services. And sometimes they don't even know what they want. They just know that they, they need some help right now. Sandy Bromley says it can be difficult and triggering for survivors to hear these accounts on the news and the way people react to allegations. She says their staff has been responding to victims no matter when their assault happened. I think we don't realize how many folks have been impacted by sexual violence in our communities. And so having somebody speak out about it so publicly um, really allows the rest of us to come forward and speak our truth as well. Terrifying that there are so many hurt, but what is important always is that we tell our own truth, we be believed, and we get help. Women's rights advocate Deborah Club believes between the Me Too movement and Ford's story, tough conversations are just beginning. We're really just at the beginning edge of talking out loud about what is done to women and girls, and sometimes also to boys and men, and coming to terms with that in terms of what people need to get through it. Now, if you or someone you know is a sexual assault survivor, you can contact the Rape Crisis Center. Their number is 901-222-4350. Live in the studio, Mary Joola, Local 24 News.